Gunner High School has got one of the best football teams in Texas, but what happened at their middle school game Thursday night could be better than a gold ball. KTN's Remy Monahan is here to tell us about a special Gunner Tiger. Remy. The Tigers make show-stopping plays every Friday night, but last week's middle school game might take the cake for best play of the year. Take a look. I didn't have a lot of friends. Bryce was one of them. We were together all the time. In life, and especially on the football field, childhood friends quickly become your family. Their friendship is amazing. It's, um, it's truly like no other. From soccer to t-ball, Bryce Bureaus and Garen Getz were inseparable until age eight when the Bureaus family's lives changed forever after a visit to Children's Medical Center in Dallas. It wasn't until that, about that last hour we were about to leave, they were checking us out and they came back and set us down and you know, told us this is, um, Um, sorry. This is, um, what it is, it's, it's AT, and in about two years, he'll be wheelchair bound, and I did not believe that. I was like, no, he played baseball last week. Like, no, this is, he's good. AT is a rare and complex neurodegenerative disorder that impacts just one in every 40,000 people. By age 10, Bryce needed a wheelchair full time, and the Bureau's family was looking for a change. The Getzes were like, y'all got to move out here. This community, the support that, that you can build a place for Bryce that's conducive to him. Um, and thank goodness we took their advice because here we are. Three years later, the Bureau's are proud to call Gunner home, and Bryce has found his way back to the field. What's your favorite part? Um, I don't really have one. But everything is. He's like the glue to our team. He keeps everybody a team, and uh, he's definitely the MVP. After experiencing Bryce's impact on the sidelines, his teammates asked their coaches if they could devise a plan to get their MVP on the field. Taking the field right now, Fear Gunner Tigers, number 24, Bryce Beros. Yeah. When they called his number and his name out there, and that crowd started cheering, it was, we said, it's happening, it's happening. He gets a handoff on the right side, and he's at the five. He's going in to score. Touchdown, Bryce Beerus! What was going through your head, you know, kind of in that moment? That's not, not dropping the ball. <laughs> but you didn't do that, right? You got all the way to the end Yeah. <laughs> that was the best night ever. It's hard to hold the tears back when, you know, getting to see your son score a touchdown. I've never scored a touchdown in a middle school football game. And um, uh, we talk about it all the time now. We haven't stopped talking about it for two days. The kindness of White Wright and Gunners players and coaches combined with the passion and perseverance of an eighth grader culminated in a moment that won't soon be forgotten. Yes, he has this memory of a lifetime, but we have the memory of watching him go through that and his smile and just, we got to watch him take it all in and. You can't top that. It's hard to beat a game like that, but Bryce is looking forward to watching the varsity team make their way back to Jerry World this fall.